Yeah, it's a boy gaming here. Since a lot of viewers are shouting out for more tutorial on vlogging, so I immediately throw away my phone and start to work, 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 work. After the endless night, finally the video is ready. So if you enjoy the video, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel. This is definitely motivate me. Thanks in advance. If not, I'm going to squeeze your bubble. Let's start off all of the bullies first. First is Akagi's alley oops. Do not stand in front of him if your strength attributes are not as high as him. Try to stand on his side when he is at his maximum stretch of his hand. Jump. Same concept goes to Akagi Audi. When he jump to the pit, block again. Do not stand in front of him. Next, bully is Naito, the boss. This is pretty simple for him. When you see he is going to toilet, then jump and scare him. I feel so sorry to miss Swain next. If he doesn't have any bodyguard to scream for him, he will have a bad time if everyone watch my video. And again, who is the awesome guy that will hit the like button and subscribe my channel? That is you. Mitsui first skill set is turn around layup. This one everyone should know how to block. This is the job for Stantus or the only power forward under the basket. When you see him turn around, then block. Should be like this. Although he steps back and shoot, the center still need to jump. The on-ball defender must go for his step back. The second skill is step backs and shoot. When the ball was brought to his head level, jump. Positioning is on the zone of his fan shape. Last would be his fade away. The defender must stay close to him. After he jump, then just follow him to jump. This is for his ulti normal shooting tree. The timing is different after he use his ulti. You need to jump as per he jump. This is testing your reaction speed. I hope Miss Swiss player do not come and hit me. Next is our Rukawa. Let you guys to practice once again. Blocking timing for Rukawa first dunk point is when his head cross the net. You have to jump before he is reaching to his vertical peak. His second clutch would be he used both hands to hold the ball to his stomach. I know some people are holding grudge against him. Let's have a blocking feast. That's wrong. Lastly, it's Rukawa's fade away. Same concept to miss Wave fade away. The defender has to stay close to him and follow him to jump. If you learned something from the video, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel. This motivate the panda more. Thanks. I will be back.